We are here at in Mil down in downtown Milwaukee, and we are going to, or I'm going to do my first float session here at Float Milwaukee. 211 Freshwater Way, I believe is the name of the uh, address. I got my stuff packed for afterwards. First time ever here, so. Wish me luck. Hello. Hi. Hey. Are you Randy? Yes, I'm Randy. Can you put them over there and get some slips? Sure. Right over here? Yeah, right over there. Oh, okay. Thank you. Some I like I like with RC stuff or whatever, and I put on YouTube and that kind of stuff or whatever. But yeah, I always find that you know the hands-free ones are a little bit easier and stuff like that. I'm just gonna. Yeah. Um, Altered States years ago. I mean, I'm sure you guys probably have heard of that movie, the old one. Yeah. You heard about yeah. It. Um, but mostly where i heard about it is uh, or i got interested in it was through the uh, the joe rogan podcast i mean he's big into the flotation tanks mm -hmm. you say you have pools and pods yeah yeah i i would i i want to said i would definitely want to experience the the dark the the meditative you know no sound no nothing yeah. for the first time because so i'm not like i said i'm not paranoid of the dark or claustrophobic or nothing so to me it that that's what i want to experience but i mean it's nice that the, you have pools. My son, who had just got back from Europe a couple months ago, they said they over, like in Germany, they've got big pools. And the, the pools have different degrees of salinity to them, you know, as so you can, and, uh, but they have like just, you know, where there's a bunch of people floating at one time. And it's in the open, so it's not dark or nothing. But the lights are, you know, subdued and stuff. They look like this. Mm-hmm. Kayla, Randy. Nice to meet you, Randy. Nice to meet you. You're welcome. Um, Thank you. Thank you. So in here is the post-float prep room. When you're okay. done floating, mm -hmm. you're going to take a shower in the room. You'll get dressed and then come out here to finish up getting ready if you'd like to. Okay. There's lotion, Q-tips, extra towels, kind of just stuff for you to use if you would like to okay. in there. All right. Um, there's two bathrooms. This is one of them. Okay. Okay. Instead of putting on your clothes, sure. Sure. Healthy. Gotcha. So this is the nice. What's the, uh, the who's the manufacturer of that one? I know uh, it. This is the evolution. Evolution. So I, okay. I'm not sure if that's the. I've seen these before. These are really nice. Yeah. Really nice. They are lovely. Um, I'm just checking the bullets. It's so humid. Right? Sure. Sure. Yeah, I understand um, that. Yeah. So inside is about eight inches of water. Okay. And Where the switch for the light is where? It's going to be right here on the inside. There's uh, one on the, here, actually, let me go over here. Oh, show you. sorry. That's okay. There's this button here on the left. Okay. Uh, this one's for the music. Okay. You can click that in and out, and it'll cycle between uh, low, medium, high, and off volume. Okay. And that you just kind of press in the middle. Okay. And then this one here is for the light. You would gotcha. press it in, and it slowly turns off. Gotcha. And then you press it, and it turns back on. Okay. There's this call button in the middle if you were to need anything, that oh. would be me. Mm -hmm. um, so the first thing before you get in here, we just ask that you take a shower. Mm -hmm. And then keep this closed so none of the soap or water gotcha. goes in here. Gotcha. Okay. And then I recommend 
and taking this um, hand towel here and drying your face off with it. Okay. And then you can even just keep it kind of nearby the mm -hmm. pad. Um, when you dry your face off, there's mm -hmm. no like drips on it anymore. And if you have drips on your face when you're in here, you might want to touch your eyes or something. That's and what I've heard, yeah. Yeah, and you'll get salt water in your eyes, and you don't want that, so it's going to be bad. <laughs> okay. Um, so if you do need to like touch your eyes or if you get salt water in your eyes, mm -hmm. there's this fresh water bottle here. Okay. So you can spray your eyes and then this, you can just like dab them out or um, if you want to like dry your hands off and then do gotcha. anything. Um, let's see. So you'll shower off, dry your face off. Mm -hmm. If you want to use these earplugs. Um, yeah, I've heard some people suggest to, to do that. Yeah. I mean, I don't know, I guess. It really depends on your own ear. Uh, I started using them, but mm -hmm. then I just kind of stopped because I never really had any ear problems. Yeah, I don't have a problem swimming. I don't have a problem with water getting in my ears, so maybe okay. maybe I don't need them. You can always try them out. Okay. Um, and then if you don't like them, you can just like take them out and toss them out of the pod and then throw them out. Oh, huh. um, good idea. Yeah, you'll put these in before you shower. Okay. Because they are silicone and they mold to the dry skin. And they'd slip out if they were if your ears were wet. Yep, and okay. then the water will seal it up. Okay. This is a little petroleum jelly packet. If you mm -hmm. have any cuts, scrapes, or yeah, like bug bites or anything, mm -hmm. it'll act as a protective barrier between the salt water and okay. the like open sure. and it's still almost yep. clean. Mm -hmm. Um this is for your neck if you'd like to use it as yeah. a little pillow. Yeah, it sounds like a nice idea. I like that idea. I'll definitely try that. Yeah, it uh, helps just support your neck because sometimes your neck isn't used to free floating. Mm -hmm. And um, if you don't like this, just toss it out of the pod once again. Gotcha. Just throw it right on the ground. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm just going to close this. So sure. That yep. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and we won't forget when I take the shower. Yeah, so mm -hmm. I'm going to leave and I'll start your float. Okay. You're on the, an hour float mm -hmm. and there's a Sure. <laughs> um, and then the float will just start automatically. Okay. So you can shower off and then get in and then um, just kind of get comfortable. Mm -hmm. And you'll hear a recording of a woman's voice come on. She'll let you know the float started. Okay. And then some soft meditation music will play. Okay. And you can control the music then on that left button. Right. You can turn it up or down or off. Gotcha. And I'm going to try that. I, yeah. I'm sure I should be fine. And I mean, you can always ease into it too. You can always okay. like leave it on for a little bit. Of course, it's totally fine. And then um, if the light music's off, you'll know when it's done because the music will come back on and the light will come back on. Okay. The recording will come back on and let you know that the float has ended. Okay. And then you have a couple minutes to get out of the pod. And then eventually um, you'll kind of hear the filter start going. That's when it's like really time to get out. And then you'll shower off. Yep. Let's see a couple positions. Like I think that like floating like this is kind of nice. Okay. And then if my neck or back, like my upper, starts getting kind of like tense, I'll just slowly move like this. Well, that just concluded the uh, float session here I had in Milwaukee at uh, Float Milwaukee. You can hear it uh, the filtration going down. Really nice setup. Really nice. This is where this is the room where you go to uh, unwind. I think what I am going to have is a cup of water. A little dry when I was in there, but not bad.